we end up going back and jerking off because we're like after seven days you're like i can't i just can't do it i can't do it it's out <laughs> Whew, thank goodness oh I cleared up that i can get back to work but what you're actually doing is depleting yourself of your very masculine essence and life force your ability to attract women know subconsciously whether a man is self-controlled full of vida vida means strength potency power when most people walk into a room nobody gives a shit nobody notices because they have no vida no strength no potency and that's because they've depleted it either with masturbation or some other vice drugs alcohol yo 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 what up youtube welcome to sin take man my name is jay sin coming back with another one and as y'all can see we coming live from the rose garden man take a look at it take a look at it man i'm slow mo today man we got a beautiful day out here so y'all already know I got to thank the Most High for waking me up this morning and giving me another opportunity to be great. And I want to send a big shout out to my brother and my ancestors that's up there looking out for your boy. I love y'all, man. I love y'all. Look at that. Clear blue. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Backdrop check. Backdrop check. Y'all know where we at. Backdrop check. Backdrop check. Y'all know where we at, man. You know, real spillage right there, man. You know, but I had to show y'all that clip real quick posted by Kerry Hobb. Shout out to Kerry Hobb. Shout out to the brother in the video, man. Because listen, bro, we know how hard it is out here. We know how detrimental it is out here. You know what I'm saying? To stay away from that shit. But we got to do whatever it takes, bro. Because I can't be out here like that, man. And I know you don't want to be out here like that either. You know what I'm saying? To where you can't attract nothing. To where these women can sense that you have no vera. You have no vera. You have no strength. You have no potency. You have no masculinity. You know what I'm saying? You have nothing that could attract the woman. Nothing could, that can attract blessings. Nothing that could attract abundance. You know what I mean? Good people. Good vibes. You know what I'm saying? Good times. You can't you can't attract nothing when you out here like that, bruh. You know what I'm saying? When you down bad like that, man, because I don't care what nobody say. You know, when you result into those type of actions just to make you feel good as a man, listen, you down bad. You know what I mean? Mugs don't make man, mugs be wanting to run from the truth. Bro, you down bad. If you fapping, you down bad. If you looking at that screen for pleasure, you down bad. If you need escapism from your real life, you down bad, bro. You down bad. You know what I'm saying? And it's only going to get worse the more you carry yourself like that because you're not in alignment with yourself. You know what I'm saying? You're not embracing that masculine energy you have. You're taking away from it. You know what I'm saying? So you will, natural, you will not be your natural self. You know what I'm saying? You will not you will not have that natural mindset, those natural abilities, that natural confidence. You know what I'm saying? The natural energy that you need in order to function out here, bro, as you. You know what I'm saying? Don't worry about nobody else. Don't even worry about being a man. Listen, when you do this shit, you can't even function as you. As you, the person that the most high sent here, the person that the most high blessed, the, mo the person that the most high chose to be in this masculine energy, you can't even function as you. And that's a terrible way to live, bruh. You know what I'm saying? That's a, that's a terrible way to be out here amongst the public, bruh. It's embarrassing, man. You know what I'm saying? And that's why I had to show y'all that picture, you know what I'm saying, last year or a few months ago of me when I was all bulky and shit. You know what I'm saying? I was all bulky. You know what I mean? I had muscles. You know what I mean? Popping out. Popping out. You know what I'm saying? But I was still weak, bro. I was still weak from what I was doing. I was still weak from how I was thinking. I was still weak because of how I was, you know, lusting. You know what I mean? How I was eating. You know what I mean? How I was viewing women. I had no vera. I had no vera, bro. I had no vera, bro. It wasn't nothing potent about me. I was weak. You can't be, you can't be potent when you weak, bro. Listen, bro. Your bag is huff. Your bag is weak. That ain't no endo. That's outdo. 
You know what I'm saying? Because everything about you is out though. Your confidence is out though. Your masculine energy is out though. Your co- yo 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 fucking testosterone is out though. Your confidence is out though, bro. Everything about you, man. You know what I'm saying? Your vitamins and nutrients is out the door. Your blessings is out the door. Abundance is out the door. Your light out the door. You know what I'm saying? Because your bag is huff. And that's what you do out here when you doing that shit. That's what you do out here when you under the influence. When you need all of that bullshit just to make yourself feel, you know, good. You just need, you need that, bro. So many other natural things in this life. Just waking up, seeing the sun, being out in nature. You know what I mean? Love. You know, you know, having things, you know, the, the, the blessings that you have and the abilities that you have to walk, talk, see, you know, feel, you know, all of these things that can make you feel good out here, bro. And you're going to result to that. You're going to result to toxicity. You're going to result to demonic energy. You're going to result to low vibe, bro. You're going to result to some low vibe ass shit, man. It's sad, man. You know what I mean? It's sad, bro. And once you out here with no Vera, when you out here with no potency as a man, you out here and people can sense that you have no strength, you have no control of your actions, bro. Listen, bro, people going to run away from you. You know what I'm saying? And they not running away from you out of fear. They running away from you out of protecting they self, bro. You know what I mean? These chicks running away from you. You know what I mean? Good energy running away from you. Hell, the blessings running away from you. The light running away from you. But you know what come to you? The shadows, darkness. You know what I mean? The demons running to you, but all good things run away from you. You know what I'm saying? The negativity running to you, but positivity run away from you. You know what I'm saying? Good women, real queens, they running away from you. But succubus women, they running straight to you, bruh. So they could take advantage of you. So they could drain you even more. So they could have you in darkness, bruh. So they could have you on child support. So they could have you out here broke. So they could have you out here lusting. So they could have you out here simping. So they can have you out here motherfucking pedestalizing, and validating everything else but yourself, bruh. You know what I'm saying? Because you're going to look at yourself and the things that you're doing and where you at in life. And you're going you're gonna to see that there's really nothing to validate about you. There's nothing to be pleasing about you. There's nothing, there's, not, there's nothing energetic about you when you live in that life. So that's just going to sink you even further down into the abyss because of how you look at yourself. So that's why you got to change that shit, bro. You got to stop doing that and start making the changes necessary. You know what I'm saying? So you could have, so you could see yourself how you supposed to. And that's a king, bro. You know what I'm saying? Because ain't nobody like you. You the only you here. The most high done blessed you. Most high done tapped you to get here. And what you want to do? Just waste that shit away. You know what I mean? You just want to waste your time away. Waste your energy away on nothing. Because you want to fap. Because you can't find nothing else good in life that give you pleasure, give you a natural dopamine release. You don't even realize that being productive will give you a dopamine release. Working on your health will give you a dopamine release. You know, getting out there socializing will give you a dopamine release. Staying close to the most high will give you a dopamine release. Wisdom will give you a dopamine release, bruh. All these things, man. Eating healthy will give you a dopamine release, dog. You know what I'm saying? Teaching. Creativity. Creativity will give you a dopamine release, bro. What you think your life force energy is, dog. You know, that's a real creative energy. But if you're not creating nothing, you're not building nothing, then guess what? You're going to feel low. You're going to result to nonsense. You're going to tear down because you're not building up. You're going to tear down because you're not building up. And that's exactly what you're doing, bro. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people don't realize that they're tearing themselves down. And then when you're done tearing yourself down, then what you do? You look for other things, other people. You know what I'm saying? You look for other foundations to tear down. You know? And when there ain't nothing else around to tear down, then guess what, bro? You go online and try to tear everybody else down that you see. Tear down celebrities. Tear down anything that you can find, bro. You know what I'm saying? And it's sad to see people in that state. From what they doing to they self, bro. You got to understand, you know. All of it stems from what you do to yourself. How you treat yourself. Because if you treat yourself like shit, then of course you're going to go out there and treat other people like shit. 
If you look down on yourself, then you're going to get out there and you're going to look down on everybody else. If you out here negative in your vibes, then guess what? You're going to be a negative vibe in general and negative to everything in life. Everything in life, bruh. You know, and that ain't living right. You're going to be negative to everything in life and that ain't living right, bruh. You know, you're going to be right there and you're going to be the cause of your own demise. You know what I'm saying? You're going to be the cause of your own demise. And that hurt even more for people, bruh, because listen, you know, when you ain't got nobody to blame but yourself and you sitting there old, decrepit, you know what I mean, nasty, you know, don't got nothing, unhealthy, you know, and you can't blame nobody because, you know what I'm saying, ain't nobody been around you, everybody done left you alone, you know what I'm saying, good good energy and positive energy, everything that could be good, that could have been beneficial in your life has left the building, but ain't nobody else to blame but yourself. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody else to blame but yourself, man. And that's when you start dealing with that real torture, that real torment, that real regret. You know what I'm saying? That real jealousy, that real envy. You know what I'm saying? You know that real darkness, bruh. You know? So, man, we got to just stay away from that, bruh. We got to hold on to that Vera that we have. Ain't it potent? Ain't it potent, bruh? I know y'all know, man. That's why I had to do this. I had to take that clip. Because it's, we we very potent out here, you know what I'm saying? Our bag, bro. Listen, I, I know I know the analogy is crazy, but our bag hit different. You know what I'm saying? We are not the babbage bag out here. That's the bad shit they say in Memphis. You know what I'm saying? We are not a weak bag out here. We are not a regular bag out here. We are very potent. You know what I'm saying? We will be that OG Kush. You know what I'm saying? We will be that. We will be the moon rocks. We will be that hashish out here with how potent we are in our manhood, how potent we are in our spirits, how potent we are in our energy, how potent we are on this journey, how potent we are in our masculinity, how potent we are in our confidence. But listen, they can't stop us. You know what I'm saying? So we got to keep this potency. We got to keep this strength. You know what I'm saying? Because the Most High gave it to us so we could shine bright in this light. You know what I'm saying? Because we, if we ain't in the light, y'all know the rest. Then it ain't right. All right? And that's my word, man. My name is Jason. See and take. Holla at y'all later, man. Peace.